D.O. Pearson House, Stanwood, Washington, now part of the Stanwood Historical Society. Here are some photo details of the east side of the uh, main building, the oldest house, I believe, anyway. And as you can see from the gingerbread work, they took great pride in the detail of their homes at the time, at least this one, and I found it to be intriguing and quite fascinating to shoot uh, these uh, gingerbread uh, shingles, the way they're cut, uh, the dimensionality uh, offset with the stained glass windows and the shadows, I found it to be uh, very uh, well worth my time, in my opinion anyway. And that leads us to the rest of the story. Just a little ways away, as you can see, is a uh, remodel going on on their hall. It's one of the buildings of the complex in downtown Stanwood. And you can see they are replacing, uh, that would be the south wall. And as you know, 40% of all your wind comes from the south in Puget Sound. So it's the wall that gets all the weather and this hadn't been replaced in years and years. You can see the actual shiplap up there set diagonally. Now that's probably, from what I can tell off the ground anyway, it looks like a one by 12. They, uh, they set it in diagonally, which added a lot of strength to the building. Uh, nowadays, of course, uh, lumber isn't king anymore and plywood's a lot cheaper and probably stronger. So uh, you can see it's been plywooded over and uh, Tybecked, and they plan to put a, a finish siding on it, which I imagine uh, will not only match the historical quality of the house, but uh, will probably be a much more long-lasting product, although I don't know the last time this was remodeled, it <laughs> lasted quite a while anyway. And just, uh, I'm glad to see people doing, doing this types of projects and maintaining these historical buildings. And there's a plug for Chad Fisher. He was a contractor on this. I didn't meet him, but his crew was pretty nice. Have a good one and take care.